Did that freaking mall have 35s on it when he bought it? No. Gosh, damn you! <laughs> damn it. <laughs> hey guys, uh, I bought another truck. <laughs> Don't tell my wife. <laughs> we found this one out in Stone, just over the, about 45 minutes away. It's the old guy we bought it from is used to use it for tractor pulls. That's what he said he built them for. So it's got a 454 in it and I took a couple pictures of loading it on the trailer, but we're gonna get it pushed off of here and I gotta use the trailer. So I figured we'd start videoing on it and maybe we'll push it in the shop and see if we can get the engine turning over and see if it'll run. I guess we'll see if she'll turn over. He couldn't really tell me when he parked it or last time it ran. He couldn't really remember. So we have no idea. But by the looks of all the stuff everywhere, it's been a while. So it looks like it's just got a quad jet. Um, oh, he's got an Awuga horn. We gotta test that. We gotta test the Awuga horn. We'll have to test that at some point. Oh, look at this. We got a little box. How many spare parts we got? Hey, hey, does that tell you how long it's been parked? That is an oil can punch funnel. Old oil can. That's like, looks brand new. That's been in here a long time. We got spare belts, a breather cap, and transmission fluid. We're probably gonna need that. But, let's get a, I don't know if I really want to lay or try and get it to crank by hand. I think we're just going to throw a battery in it. I'm lazy. But we do have keys too. There's no title either. No title. But there's keys. So. Maybe that'll tell us how long it's been parked. Where's the date? Oh, there's no sticker date. But that's an old battery logo. 
limited warranty. Oh, here we go. August of three. So 2013 or 2003 or 93, we don't know. A three, it definitely wasn't 2023. Well, let's get a battery. We got oil? Oh yeah. Right on the full. Oh, it's still slick too. <laughs> the fan turned on. We're gonna unplug that. We don't want that screaming at us all day. So, I like buying these batteries because then it doesn't matter what you're working on, top post or side post, it doesn't matter. You've got a battery that'll fit whatever you need. All right. I'm going to turn the key. Let's we'll see what happens. or anything. Oh, I got a brake light that's kind of trying to work. Well, oh, dang it. All right, well, uh, let's grab a push button and see if we can make it crank. I think. So this one got power. Hook up that side. works. <laughs> well, do you hear anything at all? No, I think the solenoid is bad. Yeah. Hard to turn, but the, the solenoid's not working. My stash of starters. We're gonna test a couple of these. Got power. That one doesn't want to spin. Yeah, that one don't spin. Let's test this one. That one works. Well, it worked once. There we go. Now we'll check this one. Oh, that one sounds the best. That one sounds good. We're going to try that one. Okay. 
Off the <laughs> that was close. Maybe we should get somebody that knows how to work on cars. What'd you say? Nothing. <laughs> Good old HEI. <laughs> Alright. We got something happening. Let me grab bottles. I'm waiting for the rat's nest to shoot out. <clears throat> Live mice. Well, there wasn't enough in there. We'll see. Timing's a little bit advanced. Just hoping I had some gas in a jug, but I don't think I got it. Oh wait, I got some two stroke out back. Oh. Got a little two stroke gas here. Fill the float bowl and then see if it'll run. <laughs> <laughs> if you, in case you wanted to know, that's my brother. Alright. <laughs> oh. Careful. Okay. Almost. Ready to go? Yeah. <laughs> yep. Just a little is fine. <laughs> I don't want 
to run, I know what comes next. <laughs> That's right. I don't want to do burnouts. That should be enough. It's blowing everywhere. Yep. <laughs> Oh, yes. He says, I'll be good. I'll be good. Don't, I'll be good. I'll be good. Just don't. Don't blow me up. <laughs> don't hurt me. <laughs> Are we doing it again? Well, I'm trying to decide if I undo the fuel inlet. Oh, there's old gas down there. Oh, it's good. trying to suck fuel. Oh, good. I'm sure old gas from 1998 burns. Yummy. Really good. <laughs> Hey, did, you, did you say it did have oil pressure or? Oh yeah, he 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 looked at the gauge. It had pressure. Better try it again. I'll watch it. Okay, one sec. Let me just go forward. it should probably fix the fuel yeah we need to get some fuel or run it to a tank or something hey it's like hey it's like a half a half a flip off did you ever tell him why you lost, lost finger <coughs> besides you were dumb nope oh. maybe that'll be a story time for another day yep yeah. okay I got a close-up on the finger. <laughs> so, <laughs> so. <Thanks. laughs> We're going to have to film like this all the time. It'll just be giving Alan crap the whole time. Sure, why not? Oh. So Jake can freeze frame it when he ends yeah. the video. Yep. Oh, what a dumb thing. Oh, no, it's got a, it's got a safety screen. <laughs> Here. You're not allowed around sharp objects all day. That's okay. Careful. Careful. Ah, oh, my eye! There's not much in there, but... In my eye? No, there ain't much behind your eyes either. <laughs> <laughs> Alan had a comeback! That was a good one. That was good, Alan. Good job. I'm proud of you. Now, Alan's gonna show how to suck. What? He's gonna suck the fuel out of the tank. He's good at sucking. Sucking everything he does. It's in the fuel. I just either the float stuck. Oh, it just pissed it back in. <laughs> no, that was the radiator. Oh. Okay. It's either the float stuck or the or the needle stuck or the pump's bad. So let me. It narrows it down a lot. It'll look one or the other. Maybe not. <laughs> Oh, we... 
it's too late for safety. It's done blowing now. <laughs> to go it just needs some transmission fluid okay so now we put a fuel can over there down by the heater box uh ran a hose to it so the pump fuel pumps working and everything now we bypassed the neutral safety switch so now the key works so should fire right up So we uh, went for a little drive and the battery died in the GoPro. So it's on the charger, so this is on my phone. But it started getting hot and we couldn't figure out, we figured the thermostat was just stuck. Well, thermostat was stuck all right. Uh, it's got stuff stuck in it and look at the thermostat housing. I don't know how that happens, but <laughs> we're gonna, this is like an excavation or like a, a archaeological dig. <laughs> I don't know what is going on with this. I have never seen a car do this or seen a vehicle with this. I don't know what's going on.
Yeah. Look, it even says Ace, the helpful place. <laughs> guys that's gonna took it for a ride you guys saw it runs pretty good it uh, seems to drive well uh, got the brakes working again the brake fluid was just low so we got brake fluid in it and it's running good now um, we're gonna the next video we're going to put we're gonna cut the fenders out so we're gonna cut the fenders out and put some big boggers on it and uh, vacuumed all the interior out still got the bag on there but vacuumed it out uh, I did put a couple of bolts in this just at the back so it stopped sliding around but yeah we're going to the next video you're gonna see us cut the fenders out put big boggers on it and just go wheeling and that's the plan and go from there thanks for watching please like share subscribe we appreciate it very much